Hi guys, this is Laszlo and welcome back to my channel. I am a Hungarian guy and she's my Filipino girlfriend. And in the previous video, she challenged me to try to pronounce the 10 hardest Tagalog words. So if you want to watch that video, click down on the link in the description or just above. So in that video, I promise there are going to be some time for revenge. Guess what? This is the time, guys. We got 10 words prepared for her. And the task is for her to actually... Just pick one at first, okay? And we're gonna go through all of these words. And, and she has to guess the uh, pronunciation of the word first of all. And she then has to find out the actual meaning of the word, which I'm gonna assist, you know, by giving some hints. So first, she's gonna find the actual category where this word might belongs. So whether it be related to food, you know, education, culture, religion, anything like that. And then, of course, you know, I will guide with my hints towards, you know, the actual, <laughs> the actual meaning of the word. So, are you ready, love? Yes, I'm ready. So, attempt to pronounce, please. <clears throat> Vizon, wait. Vizon la tazra. Vizon la tazra. I would say it's close. If you would say that in Hungary, people would understand you. But it's like, uh, it's off. It's off from the actual pronunciation. Vizant la tazra. Vizant la tazra. Okay, let's just say, let's just Google that real quick, okay? Vizant la tazra. Oh, Vizant la tazra. Vizant la tazra. Vizant la tazra. Vizant la tazra. Yeah, Vizant la tazra. Okay, so you can say this word to people. When you meet some circumstances, you can say it to people. Uh, is it one word in English or no? Um, it's actually two words in English. Oh, help. Let's just say you can, you can say it um, when you just want to wanna be polite, for example. Oh, would you be so kind? <laughs> Something like that. You're approaching? Is it like the way you talk or ask someone? Oh, um, can I ask your help? You can use this phrase uh, in, during interaction with other people, whether it be it's one person or other, other people uh, around you, and you are about to do something. Excuse me? I will let you go? Oh, you're you very, very close, very, very close, okay. I need you. Oh my God, it's so hard! Imagine, guys. <laughs> this is my re revenge, revenge, guys. You basically uh, learn this phrase on the first first time you know you attend any English English school. On the first day, you're gonna learn this one probably. So it's like a basic. It's a very basic, very basic stuff. Okay. <laughs> oh my God, last that's just the first word. No, I mean help me to reveal. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. So it basically means goodbye. What? Oh shit! Imagine, just like. It it seems like it's libidich something like that. It's libidich. I don't what? know. I said no, no, no. no, no. no. Igizigidr. Igi igiz igizig. Oh my god. Egeje egezigedre egezigedre. Ooh, oh, yeah, yeah, getting, getting a good way. Okay. This is, is, right? this is very, this is very close. Okay. 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 okay, let me just type in real quick. Okay, okay. You know. Egezigedre. Okay. Oh, okay, yeah. Oh, mm -hmm. wow. Philippines got one point. Okay. So now all you need to do is guess what category this word might belongs to. Is it emotional? Emotion of people? Not quite emotional, but you could connect this word to people. Happy? Is it positive? It's, it's not an object. It's not an object. Is it it's a not scenario? Yeah, in, in, you can use this this word in a scenario again, just like the previous one. Okay, just give me one hint. It's a situation like this. You so, can use another it. person does something, and then you can reply to that, you know, action by using this word. Revenge! So, again, this is a word that you're going to learn, you know, basically on the first day of attending a, a Hungarian school. Love you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's too, too emotional. Try to think something more formal, okay? Annoying. It's like you're thankful. <laughs> No, no, not even, not even close. Another uh, okay, sure. Go help Go. me. It means bless you. Uzag zag paper, uz uzag paper, uzag paper. You, you know what? You sound like a French person when you pronounce this word. Uzag paper. How 
How do you pronounce this paper? Paper? Uishag papir. Ah, uishag papir. Uishag papir. Uishag papir. Yeah, I think papir is correct, right? That's what you I'm said saying. papir. Papir, okay. like your French. But anyway. Uishag papir. What, it's co- an what? object. Yes, yes, it's an object. <gasps> Flower? No. Is it can be touched? Yes. And on more on that, you're supposed to touch it. That's why they, they some companies making this product. Food, tea? No. Is it a be- basic needs? Uh, for some, not, not basic needs, so you can survive without it, no problem. Um, it's is just it some, some people want it, wants to have it. Ah, okay. So this one is a soup papier is paper. It's made out of paper, okay. It's oh, by the way, I think this is a time when you can hit the like button, the notification bell, subscribe, and of course, leave a comment below. He's enjoying. He's I'm enjoying the torture. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm going to reveal it to you. Okay. This is basically newspaper. Tuzul Tuzag. Tuzul Tuzag. Tuzul. Zul. Zul Tuzag. Tuzul Tuzag. See? The letter Tuzul. This LT. Tuzul Tuzag. So, so far away. Okay, so this is an institution. Mm. Every, every single country has this institution. It's a, almost like a basic need. So if you have any civilized country, they have it. University? Mm. College? Mm. High school? Mm. Diploma? Mm. They have vehicles. Bus. Okay, yes or no. Ambulance? Do they have vehicle clinic? Hospital? Technically, they are people. They employ people who are helping you in case of something. Emergency. Nurse, doctor. They wear uniform. The, the people working for that institution, they they wearing uniform. Okay. They usually guys and they strong. Oh, guards. No. Police. Navy, army, no. armies. No. no, no. Soldier. No. Red color is associated with these guys. Red color. Is it in Bureau of Fire Protection? Fire mm. people like fire truck. It's fire department. Okay. Yeah. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Try. Try. Pil- Pilyango. Pilyanga. Pilyango. Pilyage. Mm-hmm. Pilyago. Oh, uh, uh, close, but say the N as well. <laughs> Pilan. Pilango. <gasps> oh my gosh, she nailed it. Ah! Pilango. Pilango. Okay, it's a- Pilango. Pilango. And now you need to guess, you know, what, what you know, category this word belongs to. Is it to. animal? Yes. Pillar. What? Pillar? Yeah, caterpillar. Yes. Butter- caterpillar? Butterfly. Yes! <laughs> oh, fuck it, that. that was great. Yes, because of the word pilla. Pilla. Pilango. Pilla. Yay! Yeah. Yes. You're gonna suffer with this one, I'm pretty sure, for quite okay. a long. <laughs> Ju. Julitiz. Uh, wait. Julitiz nap. Zilla. Zilitizna. Zulitizna. 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 Ready? Yes, I'm ready. Zulitizna. Zul. No, I said snake. 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 Zulitizna. Vast majority of people are going to have it. Some of them are going to have, you know, multiple times. And if you are unlucky, you don't have it just once or not even once. Ring? No. Uh, clothes? No, it's nothing to do with clothes. Uh, is it, it like something to wear? No, it just, this, this thing is just happens to you after a while. Married? Mm. As the time passes by, it can happen to you or it will happen to you. Unless something happens which is tragical. Mm. Reincarnation? Oh, sorry. No, <laughs> no, 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 no. no. People like to celebrate this kind of thing. Festival. Birthday. Oh, yes, is it. Birthday. Yay! Here it comes again. <laughs> Earlier, guys, it's a Z. Now, CS. Mm. But I think... Shoot or talk. Ooh, that's, that's good, good. Yeah, good try. Shoot or talk. Um. Shoot or talk. You pronounce it like shoe, but um, <coughs> you know, I think I'm gonna give a point for you for this one, right? 
Blades. Guys, because of this hard pronunciation, I'm getting. She's she's getting sick basically. <laughs> Sorry. Chutertuk. Ah. Chut. Chutertuk. Again, okay, I got it. Uh, again, this is a very, very basic word. Mm -hmm. uh, if you go study Hungarian, you're probably going to learn it, you know, in the very few classes anyway, very first few classes. I think this word means TikTok. <laughs> no, 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 no. So I just say this thing happens uh, very often. Rare. No. Seldom. No. So on weekly basis, this thing is happening. <laughs> on weekly basis. Weekly basis. Cleaning the house? Is it something to do with the household? Mm -hmm. No, it's not. It's no house. It's not material based or anything like that. Thinking. No. Is so, it food? No. So every week you have this once, but only once. Oh, laundry. No. Cleaning. Not at all. Not at all. Exercise. Not at all. Not at all. No, it just happens. Uh, you're not controlling it. You know, it's something above you know human control. You cannot control it. Farting. <laughs> No, you, you are marking a certain time period with this name. Menstruation? <laughs> no. First day. First day? First day. See, so what is the Hungarian of Monday? Hate foo. He threw? Hate foo. <laughs> Laszlo is like joking. Are you joking, Laszlo? No, this is a very simple word actually in Hungarian. And, and you know, it's a very basic thing again. <clears throat> um, can you attempt to pronounce, please? Foldimugyoro. Ooh, it's, it's, it's a nice try. Foldimugyoro. Mugyoro. Foldi. Perfect. For, first part is perfect. Foldi, okay. Seems, sounds like, okay. Foldi. Mugyur. No. Is it gay? Mugire? No, no, no. Mug. <laughs> Fuldi Magyoro. Magyoro. Uh, no. I'm this is M O. <laughs> this one is very confusing. M O. Fuldi Magyoro. <gasps> Mugyuro. Fuldi Magyoro. Fuldi Magyoro. Fuldi Magyoro. Fuldi Magyoro. You know what? It sounds like Mudyu. Mudyus, if you will hear back. Yeah, Mudyoro. Folding? Mm -mm. No. This is alcohol? No. Um, cigarette? No. Yeah, so this, you can eat this. Uh, bread. Rice? No. Meat? No. Chicken? No. Oh my god, fold. How can fold This is basically uh, what you can eat. Um, I think it grows under under the ground. It's a plant. Something is a plant. It's gl grows. Is it cabbage? No. Nope. Cabbage or lettuce? No. Nope. There's no help is coming. It's just only you and me. <laughs> Guys, by the way, this is the time to ask you again. Please like and subscribe. Hit the notification bell if you haven't done it already. So let's get back to the suffering. A brown colored. Uh, is it like sweet potato? No. Brown, then under the ground. Yeah, it's under the ground. What the part that you eat is under the ground. Mm. And you can also roast it if you want. Peanut? Yes, peanut. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> good job, good job. Hmm. Hmm. Vituma. Vituma. Hmm. Vitumaj. Uh, vi vitumag. Of... Vitumag. Vitumag, Vitumog, Vitumog. I help you, this is a eh. Eh, ve, ve, Vetumag. Ooh, very, very close, very, very close. Vetumag. Mm. Vetumag. Vetumag. You know what, I, I pronounced it correctly. Mm. It's just like the... I, I, you close, but I help you so much. No. So I don't think I can give you a point for this. Or should <laughs> I? Should I Should I give for a point, guys? Just leave Please. it down. Leave your thoughts down in the comment section. I'm really curious what you think. Guys, okay. please do a consideration. This is my first time. Yeah. But <laughs> I enjoy so much. <laughs> Animal, plant, eat, can be eaten. Uh, it's sort of a plant, but it's not really a plant. So at the same time, it, it is plant and not plant. It has to do something with the, the previous one, you know, the... Peanut. 
pe- not not definitely not necessarily like peanut, but it's um. I think this is I know now. I know now. Uh, okay, okay, go on. Nasi limak. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> okay, a uh, cucumber. Um, uh, a lot of different types of this kind of stuff. So like, ha- like okay. thou- thousands of different kind of stuff, and it's really small actually. But this is food. It's, it's not food. It's, it's not, not food, food, but it could be food. Food of food for animals. Uh, no, no, no. So this is not grain or anything like that. Mm. On a farmland, you could see this. Rice corn. Mm. Rice. It, no. Is it a person? I mean, rice. Rice could be, belong in, in this category as well. Mm, grain. Very, very close. Very close, but not grain. Actually, very, very, very corn. close. Corn. Not corn. I think corn. This is a name to describe multiple type types of something. A lot of all, all the types of something is described by this word, okay? So right. this thing is transforming into something which you can then, you know, use. You usually put it under the under the soil. Fertilizer. No. <laughs> no. Seeds. Yes. Oh my god, you saw go. seeds. Go. seeds. <laughs> Vaxora. Ooh. That that's a nice try. Vaxora. Vak. Uh, is it the first s- s- syllable correct? Vac- Vaxora. Vajora. You know what? You're wrong. <laughs> You're wrong, but I give you a point because you almost almost managed to nail it. Okay, mm-hmm. I give you a point. Vachora. 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 Okay, so any tips? <laughs> you usually do this once a day. Take a bath. It's an activity. Exercise. Vomiting? Is it vomiting? No. It's also fun when you are alone and also fun when you have other people around you. Reading. Socializing. Nope. So this is an activity. Yeah, that's an activity. Yeah, very close, but... Drinking! No. It's a food-related stuff. Activity. It's It's very, very easy. Basic, basic. Snack. No. Uh, Coffee. First meal. No. Eating. No, no, actually very, very close, but you're not like, you almost, almost nailed it on, on the head, but you, you... Another example? I can, I can, I can give you more, more tips. This is meal, this is rice, so what the f- Again, it's a food-related activity that you can do alone or with other people. Chewing. No. Dinner. What? Dinner. Food-related activity comes with chewing, which you can do alone or with other people around you, and you do it once a day usually. Imagine the word is so, so far <laughs> from the reality. No, like you've been, you've been close. You said breakfast and I said, yeah, <laughs> that's one of the free activities. And I, okay, anyway. You, she was very close. But you know what, guys? That's it for today's video. I hope you all enjoyed. As I said, please don't forget to like, subscribe, share the video with others. And see you next time. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.